Boom, boom, now. Boom! Right, right there, where I give him the knee, mm -hmm. I get too overexcited. Look, uppercut, knee. I didn't even feel the knee, you know? Mm. And there, where I go down, you, you can see the leg is between my legs. Yeah. Instead of stepping around, hitting him in the head, I throw myself down in the guard. That's, ah. Uh, I listen to the crowd and I get like, <gasps> boom. So I make a reaction because of the crowd. I'm like, man. And he locks me down. Now he's doing a good job, you know? Holding my foot, I cannot get my knee up. You see? Mm -hmm. Right here, now I stand up, hit him, go for an armbar, go for the sweep, I, I sit down again, I hit him. So, you hear him, I'm, I, I'm actually doing okay. You know, now he gets my arm, hold the grip, so I cannot use my right arm to hit, which I'm only getting the points with my left. So, and now, I fast forward a little bit. See now, I will pass to the half guard very soon. See now, man, this one, I, 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 again, I make a mistake. Look, look, I stand up, look, boom. I miss the chin. I, I, I actually only graze the chin. I don't, I don't hit it correctly. I'm overexcited, you know? I'm like, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna win, I'm gonna win. See, now, I'm passing to half guard. Mm -hmm. This is a good position. Keep the pressure on the face with the shoulder. Shoulder of justice. Just lay down with the pressure with the hip. You know, stay there, let the minute count. Um, but, but I'm like, I'm gonna show them. <laughs> I'm still, I'm so happy right there. You see, I go for the choke. Look, my hip, I, I put my head up. Why? He just pushed me away. This is my, my, oh, this is my mistake. You see, I go to the half guard now. I will try to get out. I'll re reverse it again. To here. You see, up with the hip. Do he's doing a, doing a good job, pushing me down. I'm doing, I'm doing a, a rookie mistake because I'm leaning with my body. I'm lifting my hip, you know, to get the choke, and he just pushed me over. So why, why do you think, I mean, is that, <clears throat> what do you think, what went down there? Because you were about to win that fight. I, I, I was, uh, was overexcited. Yeah. Uh, I was so happy. Yeah. Like, man, I got him, I got him now, he's tired. I can keep on going. Yeah. Let's go for the third round. But then I felt like, hey, I love this Japanese necktie that Mas Bonell taught me. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna show them that I can choke him out. So I got like, okay, I'm lifting the hip. I'm pushing my weight forward because I was trying to take it mm -hmm. instead of letting him roll into it. Okay. And sometimes when you reach for stuff, you, you lose your focus, you lose your balance. And, and, and he's doing such a good job. Just push me over, and now now we come to the sequence that hurts very okay. much. Okay. Look, let's take it. He got my back. Go for the armbar. I sit up and I tap. Holy shit! What what, what goes through your mind when? Yeah, I mean, right. Yeah. Right there when he sits in the mount, I'm counting. Wait to the escape. I'm sitting now. Instead of defending, I'm sitting up. What I, what, right there, I was like, Enrique, good job, man. Good job, buddy. You see, you also see he's relaxed. I'm over here talking to Big John. Mm -hmm. Now, you see, you see, yeah, good job, good job, bro. I tell him, nice, good armbar. I'm telling you, see, again, again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is what it's all about. Yeah. This is what it's all about, my, like, if you're doing a good job, the other guy should, I would say, congratulations to you, and I say congratulations to him, man. So, I have nothing to say that he took the victory, he had patience, and, and, and good technique, so. 
It was a pretty good match, right? I it mean, was a good match. Yeah, it was a good fight. It was. Yeah. But but now I'm I'm, I'm I was too. How you say? I was too. Um, I was too much in focus of I'm gonna get out of the submission mm -hmm. instead of just holding myself down. Mm -hmm. I was like, I'm gonna get up and pull my arm out and he stretch my arm. Yeah. So sometimes you 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 gotta you gotta relax mm -hmm. in the defense. Mm -hmm. How much time is there left? Is this worth defending? Defending, I mean, not by of a scramble, mm -hmm. but I mean by uh, lock yourself down. Mm -hmm. He can't pull your arm. But I was like. I'm gonna get out. So a stretch. Um, I gotta ask you, Joker, do you think you think this is something to do that you know? This is you know you've been waiting for the UFC. This is a huge dream for you. I've, you know I've been following you for a little while. I know this means a lot to you. Yeah. Do you think this has something to do that you want you wanted to show the world yeah. that you belong there? I uh, wanted to show how good I was yeah. because the first round. He, he kicked my ass. Mm -hmm. I still landed more points than him. If you see the statistics, mm -hmm. I threw 170 punches against his 120 or 30 punches or something. Mm -hmm. So I was, I was throwing punches. Even if he claims just small punches, getting the points. I'm working, I'm working. Um, but when I hit with the knee, I hear the crowd, I got overexcited. Then, even though I'm a pretty routine fighter, when you're in the UFC, you start all over again. This is just a new beginning. So I was the routine guy, became the new guy. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, yeah. So it's all over again, yeah. you know. Uh, so, and I tried to do my best. It wasn't good enough. And the over excitement, instead of staying calm, mm -hmm. took me over. I should have stayed calm, waited for my chance, go for third round. Don't show them that you can knock him out. Don't show that you can choke him out. Go for the third round. Let's see what happens in the third. Because I would obviously probably have been winning the third. Mm. Me and Luis, we also talked about this after the fight mm. that he didn't have anymore. So I was like, ah. Yeah. But but that's just honest, honesty between fighters. Mm -hmm. uh, and he said, man, you were almost winning. You had this. And the only thing I told him was, no, you won. So, so there's no excuse, mm. no excuse. Congratulations to him, big victory. We had fun, no injuries, mm. uh, only 14 days. <laughs> With yeah. a sore arm that was almost was broken, um, but I was so, happy, so now I'm home. So now you're ready for your second fight here yeah. in the UFC? Yeah. And, uh, yeah. I'm, I'm in camp now, already I'm in camp, uh, ten, 10 weeks before the fight mm -hmm. and working hard on this. Uh, this one I have to win, like this one, you always have to win. Yeah. But I gotta win this, yeah. and the other guy's gotta win this. Yeah. He, he got knocked out, I got tapped out, mm -hmm. so let's see what happens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna follow you from here and see, you know, mm -hmm. it's always a pleasure following your hard work and your yes. dedication to the sport. Thank you. So hey, I hope you're gonna have an awesome camp and we're gonna get some more footage from you I will during the next few weeks.